Hey there, curious minds. Ready to dive into the fascinating world of old phrases we use every day? You won't believe where some of these come from. Let's get started. First up, bite the bullet. Ever wondered why we say this? It dates back to the times when soldiers had to endure painful surgeries without anesthesia. They'd literally bite on bullets to withstand the pain. Ouch, right? Next, break the ice. We use it to describe initiating a conversation. But originally, it referred to ships breaking ice to clear a path for others. Pretty cool, huh? Now butter someone up. It means to flatter someone for personal gain. This one's from ancient India, where people would throw butter balls at statues of gods to seek favor. Talk about a sticky situation. Burn the midnight oil is for all you night owls. Back in the day, people worked late into the night under the light of oil lamps. So next time you're pulling an all-nighter, just think of those old oil lamps burning bright. Ever been caught red-handed? This phrase actually stems from being caught with blood on your hands after committing murder. Definitely not the kind of situation you want to find yourself in. Given the cold shoulder lately, this comes from an old practice of serving leftover cold shoulder of mutton to unwelcome guests. It definitely sends a message, doesn't it? How about something that cost an arm and a leg? This saying originated from the 18th century when full body portraits were super expensive. Only the wealthy could afford to have their arms and legs painted. Who knew art could be so pricey? Ever heard, don't cry over spilled milk? It comes from a 17th century belief that spilled milk was an offering to fairies and should not be cried over. So, let's keep the tears at bay. Cut to the chase comes from early filmmaking. Action scenes or chases were often placed at the end of films. So cutting to the chase means getting right to the exciting part. No more beating around the bush. Lastly, don't throw the baby out with the bathwater. This phrase warns against discarding something valuable along with something unwanted. It originates from the 16th century when the whole family would bathe in the same water. Imagine being the last one in. And there you have it, folks. 10 common phrases with fascinating origins. If you found this interesting, hit that like button and subscribe for more curious content. Thanks for watching.